reports from the world-famous Taft Studios have now been confirmed, and we can report that the site of the beloved sound stages for the Banana Split Show has replaced joy and laughter with mayhem and murder. Join us for the shocking story as it develops. A story so gruesome it could have been ripped from the pages of a Hollywood horror film rather than the set of a bubbly kid show. The Banana Split Show has entertained kids since 1968 when the world first met Flegel, Bingo, Drooper, and Snorky. With their zany antics and catchy theme song, the Banana Splits were an instant pop culture sensation. So how did all of that good-natured entertainment lead to a soundstage full of corpses? While the final death toll is yet to be determined, we can confirm that the casualties include hundreds of studio audience members, a longtime producer of the Banana Split Show, and at least one cheating husband. It seems the Banana Splits show was canceled today after decades of on-air kids fun. And this fact might have fueled the murderous spree. Hold on, this just in. News 6 has acquired security camera footage from the scene of the crime. Unthinkable! It appears the murderers are the Banana Splits themselves. It seems these kid-friendly animatronic robots have become bloodthirsty killing machines. Authorities are furiously looking for the Banana Splits programmer, known simply as Carl, as a possible suspect. Even more shockingly, authorities have yet to locate the Banana Splits. Anyone with information on the whereabouts of Legal, Bingo, Drooper, or Snorky, or the Quartet's bright yellow banana buggy, should contact this news station immediately. Stay tuned to this channel for more breaking news. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!